Well, women in track one are important to the process. They are essential to be there. You want to problem solve, you come up with new solutions. You have to be creative. The two women have arrived at, at the center, at the heart of, of the decision making. Uh, patient, diligent, and charming. You have to be resilient. You have to know why you're there. Just to be clear about this, is right right now there are a lot of women and, uh, who are actually at the negotiating table or what is called the uh, track one. Maybe the most um, the most significant strides are being made in the peace table with the MILF where you have the current chair, uh, a woman, she was a member until uh, the past chair was appointed to the Supreme Court. So that's uh, Professor Miriam Coronel Ferrer uh, who is uh, joined by another woman in the panel. So that makes two out of five uh, members of the panel. Uh, that is uh, by Yasmin Busan now, uh, also on that table. The head of the secretariat is a woman, uh, Ayona Harihali. And then the head of the real team is a woman, a uh, very young uh, Moro woman. It used to be Johaira Wahab and now is uh, Anne Basman, uh, both under the age of 30. Uh, biases that make it difficult for uh, for her to be just as easily accepted given her credentials, her background, and her integrity to actually take on such a leading position. Sometimes you get intimidated by, by men um, who have fought on the ground for so long. The slow process of learning and understanding the entire thing. Um, I didn't believe that these people uh, could really face us before and, and so uh, vulnerability to sexual violence, uh, harassment, and you, our concept of women, you, women's human dignity. I was uh, among uh, an audience of parang very apprehensive about the framework agreement. And then of course, if they have apprehensions about the framework agreement, um, people translate that to apprehensions against Muslims. So since I was talking in front of them, it was very apparent. I'm a, I'm a mom. I'm a mother of two very young children. So it's very demanding. It's very challenging. The mere presence of women in the peace process uh, forces you people that you would uh, usually consider as very, very conservative. Uh, For the whole idea really, just as in peace building, is to build partnerships. Whether partnership in raising a family, running a household, then certainly also in building peace, in running a government, in establishing new institutions. So what's, what's the most important thing? Dapat nga, parang we've arrived. Parang it's now real, it's possible, it's, uh, it can happen. And so therefore, there's no reason why women uh, uh, would be able to influence. Women in track one are bold. They can. They need to be maybe uh, breaking out of traditional modes. They are perhaps breaking a lot of ground, and they have to be bold enough to do that. The women in track one need uh, need to rely on on sisterhood with each other to be able to continue to do what they are doing.